Okay, if every time you're doing hip thrusts, RDLs, whatever it is, and your lower back or your knees are hurting, it's probably because you're not hinging properly. So let's talk about it. The key to building those glute muscles is perfecting your hip hinge form. Okay, so to do this, you're gonna need to grab like a foam roller, a stick, anything that your gym has like this to create a straight line. Now we're gonna go ahead and put this behind our backs. So when I hinge back like this, you can see that my neck and spine are staying in a neutral position because the stick is lying flat on my back like this. Now if I were to crank my hips out like this and try and hinge, you can see that there's going to be a gap between the stick and my back here. So what you need to do is close that gap like this. So you can see the difference when I'm sticking my butt out like this, there's a gap between my back and the stick. But when I tuck my pelvis like this, I'm creating a straight line. So instead of sticking your butt out like this and trying to hinge from here, you want to focus on tucking those hips in and sending them back like this.